Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's Keys, and today we're at the tower, and I'm going to do a big Engram opening. I just finished challenge mode on all three characters for the Axis or the Wrath of the Machine raid on hard mode with my fire team. It was a lot of fun. We got a lot of great loot. I did get some exotic Engrams as well as a lot of legendary Engrams, so we're going to take a look at those today. Um, my goal today is to really... Um, I'm going to cash in these blue ones first, um, but what I want is for some of these legendaries to turn exotic. Um, that is pretty common in year 3 I find, in year 2 it wasn't uh, as common, year 1 hardly happened at all, but uh, RNG is either you know pretty updated or changed, so let's go through some of these legendaries and see if there's anything that's of any value. Um, we'll also take a look at some of these items after, just to see the item quality, because in some cases I may want to keep some of this gear. And, inf and infuse some things into it, so we'll see. So far, uh, nothing's turned exotic. Uh, let's go heavy. Um, I'd really like to get a decent rocket launcher. I've got quite a few of them. Oh, Thousand Yards there. I'm excited to see what that's going to be like. Panther Ray, I'm probably going to trash that. Um, so, ATS Tarantella and the Zalo Supercell. So, let's see what the light levels are. 395, that's not really a big help on 394 right now on this particular character. Um, I Probably have some stuff I can infuse that into. Let's see the roll in a thousand yard stare. Wild Hawk, Short Gaze, Taxus. Uh, it's pretty crappy. There's really nothing there of any interest. What uh, I do have one with uh, Long View as well as Hidden Hand, and it's a really nice thousand yard stare. Uh, the Diluvian, I'm not really a big fan of this. It fires really fast, the stability is not great. Um, I prefer something with a bit more impact and slower fire rate, so I'm just going to trash this. Um, on the gear side, let's take a look at what we have. I wonder what the chest piece rolled at the Tarantella. 394. That's not going to do me any good here, but I could put that over to my Titan. I think my Titan needs a, a bit higher chest piece. Um, let's check out these boots. Um, that first pair of boots had a pretty stat roll, actually. I'll trash the other two. I don't really need um, boots per se, but the, the stats on the first boots are pretty good. I'll trash both of, both of these. For artifacts, I really just go for um, the year 3 artifacts. The Grinder's Cloak is actually pretty good to roll 35-34 out of a possible 35-35, so I'll keep that. Um, let's take a look at the Gauntlets. Um, let's see the stat roll, 54-52, eh, not that great, I'll probably just trash those. I do have some ones that are a bit better than that, so I'll get rid of those. And Helmets, 62-60, oh, not too bad. Um, oh, that one's even better, so I'll trash these bottom two here. Um, I'm probably going to keep the, that first one. I'll trash the second two. Don't really need those. Um, so, all in all, not a lot of great loot. Nothing dropped super high. The Panther Ray, let's take a look at that. Uh, yeah, nothing. I'm not a huge Panther Ray fan. I know it is uh, you know, pretty popular in the Crucible, but it's just not my type of weapon. Well guys, there you go. A lot of it turned into legendary marks. Unfortunately, I did get a nice pair of boots, a nice helmet. I did get some infusion fodder for some of my other gear as well. Well guys, that's it for the video. Leave a like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you in the Destiny Universe.